All right. Well, I am. Uh, I'm gonna head up to breakfast, and I will. Uh, I will talk to you. Uh, talk to you later on. All right. See you. In. Bye. That was my sister. She's going to work. Getting ready to head upstairs to meet Jay from Taylor for breakfast, and uh, then go start our day. Welcome to Nashville. What's up? Hey, Glenn. So I, I, they had Starbucks coffee in the um, in the fancy lounge area uh, where we had breakfast, which is super cool. Um, so I'm back here in the room, getting kind of organized and packed up. I'm gonna let it be a surprise where we're going, but it's gonna be really awesome. But while you wait for that, uh, I want to tell you a little bit more about while we're here. And to talk about this a little more fully, we're gonna go back to my studio in Ohio. Okay. All right, so I'm back here in uh, in my studio in my house in Ohio, and I just want to talk a little bit about the origin of kind of how this thing uh, all got started. I spent about 17 years working for a store that sold tailors um, and was a big part of the, the kind of um, musical instrument retail space, or MI retail. I've spent a lot of time going to the NAMM show in Anaheim and the NAMM show in Nashville. I traditionally spend a lot of time on like panels and best in show and all that. I'm, I'm still doing one panel, but it's for a friend and he's really cool and it's just fun and I, and I just want to. Over the past few years, I've been part of a cool group on Facebook called Taylor Guitar Owners Group and it's a, it's a giant worldwide group of people who own Taylor guitars. And it's been a cool opportunity to get to know a lot of people and you know from different walks of life different countries different viewpoints and just share a, a mutual love and admiration of taylor guitars around the same time i started doing some writing for taylor's website for their blog and i've written a few articles for them i'm looking forward to doing a bunch more in the future so because of those things and my history um, with the folks at taylor guitars there's just a cool opportunity to go to nashville and just kind of show what it's like in light of that i'm going to move this along and get back to nashville So quick update, we are here at Southern Grounds, which is Zach Brown Band's recording studio in Nashville. We are filming some videos for a new guitar that is going to be coming out tomorrow or the day you're going to see this actually, so it will be very timely. Um, I'll show you some of the behind the scenes of what we're doing here in the studio, filming uh, filming these guitars, and you'll get to hear some cool stuff. How's it going, folks? Hi. Cameron. 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 Nathaniel. 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 It's Gabriel, and he's What's vlogging up? a whole bunch of stuff. How's it going? How's That's it going? Taco Tim. Sorry. He's up there. We're going to shoot you up there, actually. Anyway, he was How's it going? Excited. I'm sneaking upstairs. We're just about to roll tape on our first artist of the day. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> it's like, it's like mesmerizing. I know. I'm just messing around. I just wrote that. Like Mike Osman was like, yeah, to hear this dude, like mesmerizing. <laughs> so watching it firsthand, like live, yeah. it's mesmerizing. It, oh, it's thank like, you. It, it, yeah. It's not, it's, it's really, really oh, good. Well, that's, that's made my day, man. That's beautiful. How's it going? It's not Daniel. Daniel's child. Oh, thank you. That's Gabriel. How's it going? Like a game. <laughs> um, so this one. That's totally brand new. Okay. So we might get a couple of takes, a couple of flowers. Uh, yeah. And I've never picked up a tailor that I wasn't like, ooh. Um, I th I've never played a progression quite like that. 
So there's that one, or you could play this one. You choose. Is this the new new? No, these are both V-Class. Okay. That's just an A14CE with V-Class. But tonally you might like one more than the other. Yeah, okay. Do you actually remember the first time you picked up a Taylor? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I do very easily. I was uh, I was in a guitar center, and they had left the ladder, <laughs> and I was like, I bet that that's one of those eight or nine, twelve or fourteens, uh, and I, it was a just a regular old E instead of the C E, and I was like, I'm just gonna just help myself, you know, up the ladder and. Was not caught. It's that sense of I don't need to set this up. I don't need to do anything other than just play it and and let it tell me what I'm supposed to be doing on it. It's almost like it's you're not playing the guitar. You're just having a duet with it. This one's slightly out of tune, but <laughs> we're just taking a minute and getting set up for the next shot. Great. Using it because you kind of see the yeah, you kind of see the edges, but like you don't really know. And so Andy's gonna give. Really good. I'm looking forward to your tour, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good studio. I did the floor, actually. Yeah. 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 This? That, was, that was supposed to be next, but came in as too fancy. And then we couldn't make next out of it. <laughs> yeah. We sent it here. Yeah. At the same time, Zach wanted some stuff, so we did that. I love it. Yeah. Uh, you want a cup of coffee or something, or are you good right now? Coffee is a really good idea. <laughs> don't, don't wreck. I, um, uh, I'm here with a buddy. We're, we're FaceTiming my friend. Say it louder. Well, thank you. I'm really what? glad to hear that. What? Can y'all tell Mr. Powers? Okay, so that was an extremely successful uh, first day in Nashville. We're wrapping up here in the studio. Everybody's packing up gear, so I'm gonna go help and get back and, and start this edit. Thanks to Andy Powers and all the amazing musicians who played today. Really excited to see what tomorrow brings. This is gonna be great for my, my first vlog, a softer side of Andy Powers. <laughs>